Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Harrowform here and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer your worlds from Minecraft Pocket Edition to Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. So, as you guys can see, so this is the world that we are going to be using world import. This is the name of the world and basically all you have to do firstly is go ahead and grab your phone charger. All right, um, you most probably will have a USB type C, but if you have a USB B, it's totally fine. It's still going to work. It doesn't really matter. And so yeah, just go ahead and grab that. And once you have grabbed your phone charger, basically what you need to do is connect it to your computer, connect it to your computer and then connect it to your phone. All right. And once you do that, all right. So basically all you have to do is set it up. So if it's your first time doing it, you're going to have to set it up. But for me, it's already done that. And what you need to do is go ahead and uh, select this and then choose what happens. And then you need to choose use this USB for file transfer. And now after you choose that, it's going to open this up. All right. So I'm just going to open it up. So as you guys can see, so I have an SD card as well as internal storage. What you're going to select is internal storage because that's where your games folder is. Just go ahead and select games and then com.mojang. All right, com.mojang. And then what you're going to do is go ahead and select Minecraft worlds. Now, once you select Minecraft world, so these are all the worlds that are there. And this is my world as you guys can see. So let me just show you the icon so as you guys can see so this is my world all right the one that i started off my video with and so what i'm going to do is go ahead and drag this world you need to do this as well drag this world and place it into your documents now once you place it into documents what you can do is actually go ahead and unplug your phone and it won't really matter and now let me just head into my computer screen recorder and i'll catch you guys there all right, now that I'm on my computer, so like I said, you'll be in the documents. You need to uh, place your world in the documents, all right? So the world file should be in documents. And this is the world. Let me just show you guys once again, as you guys can see. So this is in fact the world. Now I'm just going to go ahead and close it. And now what you need to do is uh, follow this command really, uh, really carefully. Go ahead and press Windows plus R, all right? Windows plus R. And then you need to copy paste this command, all right? So the command will be in the description down below. What you need to do is go ahead and copy paste it and then go ahead and click on enter. And once you click on enter, basically you'll see this over here. What you need to do is go ahead and click on local state. As you guys can see, I'm hovering over it. Local state and then head into games. All right, head into games. Com.mojang. And then over here, what you need to do is go ahead and select Minecraft worlds. This is important. Just go ahead and select Minecraft worlds. And now what you're going to do so is go back. And then you're going to go ahead and drag this and place this into Minecraft worlds. All right. So as you guys can see, so I just did, uh, so I just did that. And now what you're going to do is go ahead and open up Minecraft Windows generation. And guys, so once you open up Minecraft, basically you'll see it over here, right over here. So all right, so I just added into the world. So the world name was world import. If you if you do not believe me, just go back and check it. And as you can see, so this is in fact the world. We were on this island, guys. And yeah, guys, so this is basically how you import worlds, how you transfer worlds from Minecraft Windows Pocket Edition to Minecraft Windows 10 Edition. And if you guys did find this video useful, then make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Now, goodbye.